Hey guys, welcome back. Um, I have another uh, book review for you guys, as promised. Um, I have Bound by Night by Amanda Ashley. Um, this book. Oh, this book. I loved this book, but before I get into it, I'm getting ahead of, I'm getting a little ahead of myself. Um, the tagline for this one is "A Vampire's Kiss is Forever." Her taglines are beautiful. They're always so mysterious. I love them. <clears throat> now I'm going to read the back for you guys. Once featured in a horror movie, the crumbling Wolfram estate is said to be haunted by ghosts, witches, and worse. But Elena doesn't believe a word of it until she spends the night and wakes up in the arms of a compelling stranger. Tall, dark, and disturbingly handsome, Drake is the most beautiful man Elena has ever seen. For centuries, he has lived alone, and Elena is the first woman to enter his lair and survive. And Drake is the first man to touch her heart and soul. By the time she discovers who he really is and what he craves, it's too late. Bloodlust has turned to love, and Elena is deeply under Drake's spell. But forever comes at a price for each of them. Okay, this is one of my all-time favorite... Well, I really shouldn't say that because I say that about everyone, but this is definitely... Uh, I would have to say this is my number one top favorite because I love the fact that this has so much rich history in it, and I really, really liked that. Um... The whole, the whole thing about the, the, that, the interesting and fascinating twist on vampires, um, with the, um, the fortress and, um, Drake's family was so fascinating. And, um, because in, in this book, vampires, or because there's two different species of vampires, the vampires like Drake, who are born vampires, and then a, uh, of the other species is called the Others, who are um, turned by an exchange of blood. Now, the Others are only mentioned in, mentioned in this book. In, they, they, uh, they, do, they do appear more in the sequel, which is Bound by Blood. And I'll get to that. But this was so good. I really liked this book. Um... <sighs> Honestly, out of all of the Amanda Ashley books I have ever read, no story, no book by her have, has ever been more compelling than this one. Because the love between them felt strong. It felt powerful. It felt so strong that nothing could tear them apart. No matter, no matter everything that they, over, they, they, they did and overcome, it felt like nothing could tear them apart. Like, their love was so strong that not nothing could could stop them, not even death. And I that's that is really one thing that I absolutely love. Now I'm gonna read a one of my all time favorite quotes from this book is from chapter hold on a second. From chapter nineteen it's more towards the end of it. Or middle somewhere. <clears throat> This quote is from Elena. She says, and this is what she says, I'll love you till my dying breath and into eternity. I loved that. That line alone, I can't tell you how many times I reread that and reread that and reread that. Because it was just oh, amazing. And it shows so much about her devotion to him about how much she truly loves him. I mean, she loves him so much that she that she that she would almost she would give up her life for his if it meant that he lived, even though she didn't. Ah, uh, I loved I loved this book. This book was amazing, and like so many others, amazing doesn't say it. It really doesn't. Um. I mean, I've read this several times now, but then again, this is the first time I've just had the time 
to actually do a video review over it because this channel is new. I had to create a new one because my old one was messed up and so that's why I created a new one. And um, I know with my old one I didn't do very many videos because I just didn't have the time or a phone or a computer to do or so, but now that I do I want to actually do more. Um, I really do hope you guys pick this book up because this book is amazing. It really is. Um, you will not regret reading this, I promise you. Um, this this is outstanding, Amanda. A Amanda Ashley, if you are watching this, high praise. One probably one of the best books I've ever read. Out of all the books I've read in my 22 years this one is probably number one and probably will remain number one for pro for probably forever because um, the connection that they create on here that between them is so strong I've never read a book before where their relationship and the connection they feel toward each other is so passionate and so strong it just I don't know it just it makes makes me I don't know I really can't describe it. It's just something you feel. But it was outstanding. I I I really liked it. Uh, her uncle, Elena's uncle. I don't like him. He is one of those characters that you hate so much you wish you could uh, jump jump into the book and uh, you know uh, choke him to death. <laughs> and um, spoiler alert now. Her uncle does die. And um, I, I, I have to say that was quite pleasant to read. Um, I was really excited that the Elena got pregnant in this book because um, it was really it's really exciting and motivating for for characters to love each other so much, and then they have this um, this precious new life that that comes into their to come that comes to them and it just makes everything feel more alive I mean I've never had I've never experienced this before but I would imagine if you and your spouse love each other so much and then you have you bring someone else that just makes everything even more special it is I would have to say there's nothing greater than that well, this is the end of this review. I hope you guys liked this. Um, and just to let you know, I gave this 5 out of 5 stars. Um, please do pick this up. Um, you will not regret reading this, I promise you. I know I didn't. I've read it probably about 5 or 6 times now. And it was just wonderful. I, I really, really liked it. Um, I hope you guys do pick this up. You will not regret it. Um... I will see you guys next time, and um, happy reading.